They say the history of the world can be found on your dinner plate. So what does the food here say about Madagascar? Two hundred fifty miles off Africa's east coast, Madagascar, the world's fourth largest island with some of the most unique culture. Down here in this area, you feel like really like the real man. Yeah. And like all the girls fell in love with you, you need to fight with those people. And cuisine I have ever come across. Sishi. Tourism plays a key role in Madagascar's development strategy. The tourism is supposed to bring a lot to this uh, country. The big draw for tourists? A golden bamboo lemur. 90% of the plants and animals on this island can only be found here. So that is uh, one of the highlight species here because someone discovered this here in 1986. But there's a problem. In some place, it's not a taboo for them to hunt the lemur. So some tribe in Madagascar are eating the lemurs. Conservatories are racing to save threatened species and educate locals on their value. They don't understand the value of the, the, the nature. So now we cannot educate anymore the old people because they're really used to destroy things. We educate the kids. Are you hopeful for the future? Um, yeah. In many ways, Madagascar is rich. This is their backyard. Sometimes people consider that they are poor on way of looking. Yes, but in general, they are quite rich as well because they have everything that they want. Through it all, I found people here to be kind, generous, and genuinely happy, especially when it comes to sharing food. Say I'm on my way. came here for the food. Over our six video Madagascar series, we're showing you everything. From diverse street food in the capital of Antananarivo. A lot of places are uh, serving those uh, zebu, but the combination all of the bread, the zebu, and the salad, that uh, makes this place much more special. To rarely seen village life in the countryside. He went out and he caught a load of grasshoppers. Do you eat these? Yes. yes. I'll introduce you to Madagascar's strange looking national dish. And then you see it just gets dark darker towards the inside and inside like that looks incredible and I'll even try my luck on the ocean wow what a catch you got here is this a pretty good day for you for him everything he catch every day make him happy with all this building up to a final village feast like you have never seen before what's happening now they're gonna cut it but they uh, still need to find a way to hold it well I came to Madagascar with no idea what to expect in the end I was blown away by the food experiences landscapes and people, and I can't wait to share it with all of you. Say I'm on